Welcome to QA Insights QTP tutorial series. In this tutorial, we will see what is Active Screen and how to save your script with Active Screen technology. Active Screen in QTP enable users to capture the snapshot of the application during recording session. It can be activated by going to View menu or by clicking the Active Screen button in the toolbar. Now I'm going to record a small script and you will see how the active screen is getting captured and how to save the script using the active screen screenshots. So I'm just recording simple flight application. I'm entering the valid username and password. And I am just logging off from flight. So I am done with my recording. I am just clicking on stop button. So to enable active screen, go to view active screen. Here it is already enabled. So just to click on the code in the export view. So here I just clicked the line number 1. So during line number one what i've done is i just entered the username so corresponding snapshot is being captured by qtp and it is being highlighted here in the active screen pane similarly if you click on line number two the corresponding uh, action is being getting highlighted so similarly you could see all the actions so this is active screen uh, this will be very useful uh, for engineers to understand the application and for debugging purpose. Now we will see how to save the script with Active Screen. Go to File, click on Save. So by default, you could see the checkbox is checked. Save Active Screen files. So here I am just checking the option. I am just saving the. And now we will see how the active screen snapshot being captured. So this is the uh, script uh, path, which is action one folder. So under action uh, zero, uh, there is no snapshots. Under action one, actually there are uh, uh, snapshot being captured, uh, which is in the HTML format. This is for just for learning purpose. Uh, don't uh, extract any files. Don't uh, play on uh, these files here. See here, this is the snapshots. So this will be uh, useful uh, to understand the application uh, when the application is not available. So I hope you have learned about uh, active screen in QTP. Next tutorial we will see about data parameterization. Thank you.